so hello everyone welcome again to this youtube channel so in this video we are going to talk about the topic how to download file in specific folder with selenium so in this video we are going to cover these two things first is how to download a file to the specific folder and after that how to verify the downloaded file if that is downloaded or not and third is how to delete already downloaded file so let's get started how we can do this so this is the sample website that i'm going to use for the execution so for what i'm going to do is i'm going to navigate to this website sample website and then i'm going to click on this download button then it is going to download a file so this is a sample website that i'm going to use so let's now move to the code part so here right now i am on eclipse so this is a simple java maven project that i have uh, created for this specifically video so if you see here so first thing i have to do is i have to initialize the chrome options and then i have to put the download default directory to specific location so this location i have already mentioned if i scroll up you can see here this location i have already mentioned that i want my file downloaded file at this location so you can see the folder here download for uh, download files folder so i want my file to be downloaded at this location okay so by default when you run script and any file get downloaded it is going to be saved at default location default download location but because we want it to be saved on the specific location so we have to set our location here so you can again see that i have initialized the chrome options then after that in the preferences i put the download default directory to the location and then simply i set those preferences in set experimental options method and then these chrome options i have used while initializing the chrome driver so let's again reiterate you have to initialize the chrome options then you have to set the download path and then simply initialize the chrome browser with the chrome options so till here our download path is already set in the chrome options so after that you have to navigate to the website and then simple selenium actions you have to perform then you have to click on the download button then i just put some wait to get to to wait for the file to get downloaded and after that i am asserting that if file is downloaded so let's move to the verify download file code so till now i think you have understand that you have to set the path in the chrome options and it is going to set a download specific download path for you so let's move to the next part that how can i verify once the file is downloaded so now the file is downloaded so i have to verify if the correct file is downloaded so how can i verify that so here if you see here in the code in the verify downloaded file method so you can see that i have put the location and this method is this uh, this is going to return a folder okay then folder dot list file is going to return you all the files in that folder and after that i will iterate each file in that folder and if that file is file then only it is going to come inside this if loop if it is a folder or any other thing any other thing it is going to reject it so once it comes under the if condition then i'll get the name of the each file and then simply i'll match it with the expected file name if i click over here so you can clearly see i have already written the name here what would be the name of the file that i'll download so if that matches it is going to return true and if it is not it is going to return the false so that's how we are asserting that what file we we want to be downloaded if it is that only or if it is any other file getting downloaded so this is the assertion method of verify downloaded file simply 
you will have folder then you will have you will have all the files under that folder then you have to iterate each and every file and then you have to simply match the name and if it matches it means it's the file that exact the file that we have downloaded okay so now if it is true then this would also be true then it this is going to pass the assertion so we have all, also covered how to assert the downloaded file so in the starting of the video i have uh, shown you that there were two things that we are going to cover first is how to download a file at specific location and verify the downloaded file and second second is how to clean directory this part is very essential because every time we are going to run the same test case we are going to download the same file so this test case is going to be failed because every time we are going to run it so the file name would be like this like this because same file you are downloaded and you are not deleting it every time right so we would require a deleting code as well so that i have already written here so first of all it should be before uh, the i'm running the test so before running the test you have to clean the directory and then simply you can run the simple test of downloading so how it works is so first of all you have to uh, again the file it is going to return the folder and in that folder simply clean directory is a method it is going to clean all the data in that folder okay so now sometimes what happens is that this file utils is uh, if you try to write file utils in your code uh, you can get an error because by default you cannot import file utils you have to download you have to sorry add the this dependency in your system in your pom.xml you have to add this dependency in your project then only you will be able to use the uh, the file utils method okay if you come across this issue you can simply add the dependency and you will get no errors while using file utils so then the method is clean directory it is going to clean the folder and then it is going to run this download file and because we have uh, write it in the before annotation so first this is going to run then this test is going to run so every time before running the test it is going to clean the directory and then it is going to so then it is going to run the test so let's let's start let's see what is happening once we are uh, doing when we are executing the test case okay so now prompt driver should open it should navigate to it clicked on download button file is downloaded and you can clearly see here that file is downloaded okay now let's try again so because it is going to clean the directory so second time it should also get passed so let's let it again run again navigated again clicked on download button and file get downloaded and you can simply see that again the test case is passed so that is how you can download the file at specific location because this is the frequent problem in the project that you want to download some csv and you want to put it in some uh, some location so that's how you can do it here okay so so that's all from this video i hope you like the video if you like it please subscribe to my channel thank you